Hey everyone, Kirby1 here, and this is your Daily Dose of Dominions. I'm just going to jump right in. Usually I skim the play just to see what happens in the turn, but I don't remember what happened, so we're going to go in. I think I meet one or two other people, and it's just more expansion battles. Alright. Search for magic sites, none found. There's Niflheim. Profitizing is Jarl. We got a expansion when as expected. Another expansion also when as expected. Oh, kitty. And uh, yeah, so let's just look at this one and see how my blessing actually worked. Oh yeah, he also starts the battle with um, rain autocast. Uh, heavy rains will follow wherever he goes. Um, I don't think it really comes into play a whole lot. There aren't really a whole lot of heavy fire nations in this game, so it's not a big deal, but it's cool. So, all right, fast forward. Oh, he blesses them. Okay, well, that's good because they need it more than he does, really. And then let's see what he does. He casts Holy Avenger. Yeah, well, he's not going to regenerate, but he's also probably not going to take any damage from those arrows. Let's actually see. Da -da -da. Battle unit overview. Oh, he doesn't even get hit. Okay, well, never mind. The one thing, though, that does have problems with him is the more spells he casts, the more fatigued he gets, and he can actually fatigue out pretty easily. Yep, nom nom, eating all of them. Yeah, he's getting, he gets fatigued pretty quickly. Oh, and it's over. Okay, so that's great. Uh, and that's how that goes. Yeah, so what am I doing? Oh, I'm moving, moving him out with some more dudes. I think just to uh, give them to him. Not like he really needs them. Aha! Yes, we meet Hermor. And there's Helheim's capital. Which is great. It's just one, two, three provinces away from me. Uh, Helheim and I... Uh, one of the strategies that you can do with Kailasa is um, all of these guys, crappy as they are, terrible morale as they are, if you spam enough of them, you can use them for stealthy raiding parties. And the only one who does that better than me is Helheim. I can't see a dang thing in their lands. You will never know where their armies are. It is super frustrating. Um, so one of the things I actually wanted to do was pick up these forest provinces because I don't think I get any scouts in uh, the lands I conquer. But forests, Kailasa can recruit uh, these guys and these guys. So you can actually build your raiding parties from any forest, even without having to build forts on them. So that's pretty cool. Uh, so I want to try and get as many of the forests as I can. I want this one, I want that one. This one has a level 2 throne on it, and that's super frustrating. Um, there's another Dominion Candle there. It could be Helheim's, but I don't know. There's a whole lot of empty space here. Um, so yeah, here's Aramor. He has been expanding like crazy because of all of his mercenaries. Right? Mercenaries? Oh, he doesn't have them anymore. And we got a bunch of other new mercenaries. These guys will be good for getting in the water. I still don't get them, but you could do that. There's not a whole lot of water on this map. Just some pools over there. And there aren't any water nations or any nations that can even get into the water easily, I don't think. Um, Kailasa certainly can't. I mean, you could forge, uh, like, water-breathing items, but I don't waste my time 
with that. Uh, mine of superior iron. Useless. But that's okay. Yeah, I, I li literally took the sloth scales because I'm not going to be using resources in this game at all. Um, so yeah, I'm going to expand here. I'm going to expand here. Or, sorry, there. I'm going to site search there. Uh, I Yeah, he's not... Uh, oh, anyways, as I was saying, I want scouts in order to find people faster. This might have been a dumb thing for me to do because it loses me a mage turn, uh, recruit a mage turn. I do get two scouts, so I, I guess I was just a little impatient getting these guys um, instead of just getting another mage. But, oh well. It'll help me find people and figure out what's going on in the world. So that's a plus. So yeah, we're going to expand here. Okay, now I'm just repeating myself. What do I do with research? Okay, I got... Uh, I keep flip-flopping. I'm like, do I want Thaumaturgy? Do I want Conjuration? I don't know what I want. I wound up getting Thaumaturgy because I'm like, I'll just finish it and go to Conjuration. There's like halfway there and it's only going to cost me half of the research. I'll actually get both of them next turn, so that's great. Not that I need really either of them. Conjuration is what I'm going to be focusing most on in the early game. My gem income while not... Um, oh, right. I have nine earth gems here because meeting Airmore, I sent him a message and an earth gem. Right click to read. Okay. This is my message. I'm not going to read it out for you. You can pause and read it yourself. It is very thematic and RP-like. Uh, all sorts of just Hindu stuff. I try and just kind of like spread my knowledge far and wide so that everyone is trying to keep track of everyone. Um, whether or not this is a good idea, I guess, remains to be seen. I think it probably wasn't. I think I was a little too loose-lipped in the early game with my intel. And people started to take that information and then use it against me. Especially when they thought like I was starting to look weak. Anyways, I don't actually go for this guy because I, I'm while my guys are really awesome, cavemen hit like a brick, and so I'd probably lose some people if I went in there. So I'm just going to stick with the easy militias instead. And the easy heavy infantries. Yeah, I'm not going this way because even though I don't think Helheim is expanding this way, I think he's kind of just taking his cap circle. Oh, and I'm not sending my scout on to Helheim. He's going to get spotted and killed right off, probably. Yeah, so I'm not going this way. First of all, there's Horse Tribe, and I don't want to risk my super valuable hero to Horse Tribe. But also, I'm just going to let him sit there for a while and not know who I am or where I am. Unless he's scouted me already, which in which case it doesn't matter. But I'll get him in two turns, bordered right there. So yeah. That's enough for now. See you guys tomorrow.